Good afternoon and welcome to my daily broadcast. My, um, sorry, right sequence. This is episode 467. <laughs> I'm changing things up and I forget that I've changed them. Um, episode 467 and the title of the topic today is how my client, clients benefit from working with me. Because I figured I'd out myself and also take a tip from a friend of mine who nudged me, actually nudged her audience and I was watching earlier today. So that's why I'm doing this talk. So before I jump into that, let me introduce myself so you know who I am and what I'm about and then explain why my clients benefit from working with me and how. Both of those. So my, my name is Barry Selby. Welcome to my broadcast, by the way. Um, I'm a best-selling author, speaker, and relationship attraction expert, and I help strong, successful women create and find balance in life, love, and business. I'm also a passionate champion for the divine feminine. And every day I do these talks on Facebook Live initially, and then onto YouTube and then my podcast, and I'll give you those links at the end, um, called Messages from the Masculine to Inspire Your Feminine Heart. And today's topic, and episode number is 467, and the topic today is how my clients benefit from working with me. Um, I almost missed out the word from because I was going to say how my clients benefit working with me because it's not from working with me, it's because they are working with me. Anyway, just my, my grammatical, grammatical English was coming up to confuse and conflict. So let's jump in and straight to the topic. So um, I'm noticing I cut myself shaving. To, yesterday it hasn't healed yet, so they're still wearing it. So excuse the little nick that I... Do my, I do this to myself every so often for some reason. Clumsy shaving. Anyway, getting back on topic. My topic today is how my clients benefit from working with me. As I've said four, three, four times now. And I'm going to use this so that you understand the comparison, the differences, and where I come from. Because many, for example, Sunday night I was out with a bunch of fellow dating relationship coaches. We're all friends. We get together once, well, we had been getting together once every six months. We hadn't done it for about a year and a half. We got together Sunday. There were about 20 of us there, a smaller group than usual. And we're all in the same arena, or most of them in the same arena, yet we're all different. And so it got me thinking about where I fit in or where I am different from them. You know, one of, them, one of my friends who's an awesome uh, coach, Carol Allen, she is a um, Ayurvedic astrology matchmaking coach. That's not what I do. <laughs> and she's amazing and what she does. Um, there were a bunch of people there. And so I thought, let me explain how my clients benefit working with me particularly, because I know what I do. And it's also then it's about the client, not about me, which is more effective. So first of all, um, a shout out and thanks to my friend Gina, who was talking about this on her Facebook Live earlier today. And it inspired me to say this as well, because I'm realizing sometimes I've talked about what I do and maybe I don't relate to it. So I want to make sure that I point out there what, how you benefit so that you can relate to it and then see if in fact working with me is a benefit to you. And yes, that is an invitation. So being upfront about this, not being transparent. So first of all, um, clients usually seek me out who are single women. That's the first thing on the agenda because my focus on my work and my message is towards women who are single women. Matches that way. So most of the clients who seek me out, although I have worked with couples as well, but I generally work with single women because that's the audience that I find most receptive. But again, I'm jumping back into me. Let me just talk about the clients. It's going to be interesting to do this without reflecting back on my own work. This is the challenge about being in this. I've been self-focused in my messaging for a while. So how my clients benefit from working with me? Again, they're usually single women. They've usually been through relationships where they've had heartbreak, upset, and have been maybe repeating patterns more than one time in their relationship choices. And they realize they want something deeper than just a matchmaking, dating type setup. They want someone who can go with them deeper emotionally and, and um, counseling centric wise. So how my clients benefit from me is they come to me with their um, challenges. I'll be polite that way. But the reality is for most of them, there's emotional wounding and there's also heartbreak and maybe some sense of despair about finding real love. And how they benefit from working with me is that first of all, they are... Um, restore to their true self. I'm saying this subtly, but I'm saying it more directly as well. Is they learn how to love themselves again, and I've talked about this recently a lot because I created a offshoot of my work in a self-contained thing called the Self Love Practice, and I put that link at the end as well, just so you can find it. Because a big part of this work is to really help my clients remember that they are autonomous. That it isn't going to be a man that's going to fix their life for them. This is the big trap many women fall into, and my clients learn very quickly. It's not about the men. Mm -mm. It's not about the men. 
It's about them learning to love themselves and really owning their magnificence in the world, which actually makes them more attractive to men, but also makes sure that they don't settle for less than they deserve. That's one part of the work I do with my clients. Another way my clients work, another way my clients benefit from working with me is that those patterns I mentioned earlier, that repeat cycle of relationship experiences where the relationship has changing, but the patterns don't, like the partner is different each time, but the same argument shows up, the same experience shows up, the same behavior shows up, the same issue shows up. That's a very telling sign. And for, my clients who, and for my, the clients who work with me, what they benefit from is they get to find out, one, one they get to be really clear about what that is, and secondly, they get to fix it, resolve it, heal it, release it, however you want to describe that. Because working together, we go back in time, in a sense, to go back to where that behavior pattern wiring was first installed and uninstall it. It's like software in a way, because these are kind of like computers, so, you know, use that analogy. So that's the second thing. The third way my clients benefit from me, work benefit from me, benefit from working with me, so messing my own language up, is they really learn how to get clear about what they want. For many of my clients before they work with me, and maybe for you too, having a clear vision of what they wanted was never on the radar. They were just going next, let me see who's next, and oh, that's a cute person, they asked me out, I'll go out with them, rather than getting clear about what they want. And my, clinic, my clients truly benefit by getting first clear about loving themselves, I mentioned, healing, removing, and resolving that past baggage that's been dragging through the past relationships. And also, to know where they're going. Part of this is also because of the work I've been doing myself is about getting clear about vision, intention, and purpose, but it also applies to relationship choices as well. The power we have to manifest what we want, the power we actually have to design the life we, the way we want is within our grasp. So my clients benefit from working with me by learning how to create a vision that is not just a picture on a wall, but is a manifest experience that they can own, claim, and, and um, embrace, which becomes a vibrational match, using fancy words, a vibrational match to what they want to attract, so that when they meet somebody that fits that, they know. So one of the things my clients benefit from working with me is they know what they want and they know when they find it. That's a pretty powerful toolkit. So that's three, actually it's four things, I guess. Again, learning how to love themselves and really appreciate themselves and realize they don't need somebody else to make them feel whole. They benefit by learning how to resolve and heal past baggage that is in the way of them learning to love properly. They also learn how to get clear about their vision, intention, and powerful, per powerful attraction in the world. And also know how it feels when they get there. So that's kind of four things, I think. In, addi in addition, working with, me, my, working with me, my clients benefit from having a strong, solid, trusting, safe man to reflect from, because that's one of the things I do in my work, is my clients are appreciative of the fact that I am someone they can, I'm actually probably unlike most men they've ever dated, because I'm... <laughs> Not, they're not dating me, just to be clear. My, my clients don't benefit from working with me by dating me. That's not part of the conversation. Let me be clear about that. But my clients benefit from working with me because they get to feel and experience what it's like to be relating to a man who's grounded in his truth, a masculine man, that maybe they never crossed paths with before. So for a lot of my clients, they get to have a new experience of realizing that men aren't the way they used to be for them. I'm not going to say what that was because that everyone, everyone's different in their experience of men. But for most women... Their experience of men has been generally negative by the time they've gone through a few bad relationships. So my presentation, my, my, my participation in the conversation with them is such that they learn how to trust men again because they learn what a man who's trustable is like. So that's number five. It's quite a few things, actually. Um, another way that women benefit from working with me is they learn just how amazing they really are. I'm a big cheerleader with my clients. And for a lot of women, they haven't heard that from a man before. From their father, from their brothers, from their past relationships, from their ex-husbands. They've never felt inspired by a man before. So they've been, been cheer-led by them. Um, sorry, I'm what Marsha, Marsha just said. You can attest that's what Barry conveys about his coaching has proven accurate for me. I have... I can't get to the see more. Okay, I'll come back to that afterwards. Thank you, Marsha. I appreciate that. But this is the thing. Thank you for that feedback. Well, I really appreciate that. I want to make sure that I take a moment to say how much I appreciate you giving me honest feedback because I'm what, what I'm saying 
this confirm. I guess it's, I would say, not trying to be over boasting, but this confirms the truth for me, that what I do is this. So my clients benefit from working with me in the fact that they really get to know how magnificent they are. My, my cheerleading isn't just like, rah, rah, you're amazing. I just show them what is really true about them. And so they learn how to really trust themselves and own their magnificence so they become um, who they're really meant to be. So that's number seven. Seven, yeah, seven. Um, there's one more piece in that same thing, which is a lot of women who, women who work with me, my clients who work with me, start to know how to take charge in their own lives again. One of the biggest things that my clients discover is the power they have. So many women have been taught over the years to play second fiddle to men or to not have what they want or to put up with things or to give up things they wanted for certain things that don't work for them. And in my work with my clients, what they learn from me, there's Gina. <laughs> Hi Gina, I'm using, I just took your share in your Facebook Live to my heart and use that as my message today, which is how my clients benefit from working with me. So it's on number seven, this is number eight, about learning. <laughs> I teach you more, thank you. I appreciate that. Um, so that, oh yes, this is the one. So number eight was that my clients, when they work with me, they learned how just amazing, how much um, dominion they have and power they have over their own lives. Because up to that point, they may not have learned, known that. So they learn from reflection and from feedback how to do that. And yes, they do learn self-care and boundaries. I think I kind of covered those, but I'll reflect them again. Thank you, Gina. My clients do learn definitely about self-care. That was the self-love piece I talked about at the beginning. But also boundaries is a good one too. Thank you for that. They learn how to say no. It sounds crazy to say that, but so many women out there, maybe not you, but other women you know, have been in the place of relationship where they didn't know how to say no and set boundaries that were clean without feeling they were offending somebody or they'd get hurt. And the truth is, ladies, you get to set up any boundaries you choose. It's your freedom to do so. So that's number eight or nine. I've got a few now. Um, I think you're the point here that my clients get a lot of value from working with me and also get to really own their power and magnificence as well so that it's not just applicable to, to their relationships. As I said in the beginning, I'm, you know, I'm, I'm, I help my clients um, find and create balance in love, life and business. All these things I'm talking about apply to everything, not just to relationships. So working with me, a lot of clients, they learn how to do their business better too because with healthy boundaries, only their magnificence, stepping into their truth and taking in self-care and self-love for themselves means they're more effective in business too. Even though it's not my focus, business coaching isn't my thing, the side effect of working with me is that business gets better too. So working with my, when my clients work with me, they get a lot of value out of this. So that, that would be number nine or number 10. That's, I guess that's, that's 10 things now. <laughs> Let's get longer, this is great. Um, so Jeannie is saying you have completely, you've completely been in that position and only now learning your value and to say no. I'm, I'm glad you are and you know I'm on your team so I'll support you with that absolutely so yes I'm glad you got that um, I think 10 is a good round number I think I, I'm, I'm sure there's more that can come up and come forward but I want to make sure you, that you get what the value is for clients because if you're watching this you're probably somebody who could be a client or you were a client or you might be a client or you know somebody who will be a client <laughs> so I want to make sure this is of an effective communication so you know it's not just I'm not, I'm not a dating coach. Let's be crystal clear. And so that's so why I don't use the term relationship coach either because I don't coach couples or relationships primarily. I do work with single women, as I said at the beginning, and I call myself a relationship attraction expert because I know how it works. And I'm an expert in that. I'm also passionate about this. So I help women attract what they want in love, life, and business. So for that, I think I've summarized everything. By the way, a couple of things I want to mention in the link. So again, this is a Facebook Live first. It goes on to YouTube and to my podcast, and I'll tell you those links in a moment how to get there. But a quick reminder I want to give you right now is, as I mentioned earlier about the self-love pace that I help my clients with, I've distilled that down into a little practice that I call a self-love mirror meditation. It's two audio meditations, a morning and an evening meditation that I've recorded for you. Yes, you get my voice in your ear, as well as a, um, it's now 30 pages you grew, a guidebook that will assist you in understanding the power and the benefit of doing this and why your life will change. So if you want to find out more about that, I'll put the link in the comments below, but as so you have it verbally, if you go to my website, which is the same as all my social media, which is Barry Selby, my name, it's barryselby.com forward slash self-love. 
Hi, Timona. Nice to see you in my broadcast. Yes. Well, thank you. I appreciate the feedback. Yes, this is my daily thing. And today's 467. Keeping keeping true <laughs> to this broadcast. So again, barryselby.com forward slash self-love is where you can find out self-love or one word. We can check out that self-love practice. I recommend it. It is a life changer. Um, if you want to find out more, if I'll try that again. If you want to find out more about my work, as I've shared a few things that you'd benefit from that, I do invite you to reach out and have a conversation with me. And you go to barryselby.com forward slash chat, simple to remember, and you can sign up there by, put, by getting on my calendar, filling out the form, and scheduling a time to talk. Again, this is a Facebook Live that goes into my business page on Facebook, also onto YouTube channel and to my podcast. So to tell you what those are, so you know where you look for them. If you watch it on YouTube, you already know. But this is a daily Facebook Live on my personal page that goes to my business page and archive, which is barryselby.author on Facebook. It then goes onto my YouTube channel, which is also Barry Selby. And the playlist is Messages from the Masculine. And that's also the name of my podcast on iTunes. So you go to my go to iTunes, look for Messages from the Masculine, and you can subscribe and download my podcast there, which is really the audio version of my broadcast. And right now I'm at 467 on videos. And I'm sorry to say I'm only at about number 40 on my podcast upload, so I'm way behind, but I'll get caught up soon. So with that, I thank you for watching as always. If you have any questions or comments about this broadcast, please put them below. If you know anybody should watch this, share it with them. And if you want help, you've got the links, you can find reach out to me. I appreciate you being with me as always. I will see you again tomorrow for number 468. Who knows what that'll be? And uh, as always, on oh, again, this is, I didn't say this earlier. This is a 5 p.m. Pacific time broadcast pretty much every day. The weekend got a little bit shifted because I had social engagements, but 5 p.m. to Pacific time, weekdays especially. So I'll see you again tomorrow at 5 p.m. Same time, same back channel. I'll see you again tomorrow. Take care. Bye.